Hello everyone, welcome back to Code Step by Step. My name is Anil. In this part of Node.js, we will learn how we can delete data from APIs. And for that, we will use delete API method. So now let's start with the points of this video. First of all, we will uh, declare a route for delete method. After that, uh, we will send data from Postman and then we will handle this data in Node.js. And after that, we will write some code for uh, delete the data from database. And at the last, we will discuss an important interview question. So now let's start with the first point and uh, create a route for delete method. So just simply put here app dot delete. As you know, if I'm just hiding this terminal, you can see that we are using get method, post method and put method for read, update, uh, insert and update data. So we will use a delete method for remove the uh, data. So again, we will send the data in a uh, query param. So what I'm just going to do, I am putting here dot ID because we will send data as a ID. In last video, we update the data with the help of name. But uh, whenever we will use ID, so we just have to add some extra code. That's why at that time we are using ID. So in a second parameter, we need a method and it will just uh, accept a request and response. And what we will do here, so first of all, let's send uh, the data so that we can just get some response. I'm just putting here done. That means everything is working fine. And what I just want to get in this uh, console.log, I want to get this ID from our postman. So just simply put here request dot params dot ID like this. All right. So after that, let's try to delete it. Uh, not actually delete it. Let's try to run it and uh, just select a delete method from list. After that, put here uh, data with the 5000 result. And obviously we need a ID. So how we can send a ID for that? Because we cannot uh, remember these all long IDs. So just copy this uh, ID from Nokia 1010 phone and we can simply put it like this. Whenever we will just hit it. Okay, so this is not responding because we have to run this application first. So let's run this uh, node moon api.js. Now it should uh, give some result. Here you can see that this is the status 200 and it will return done. Everything is working, working fine. Great. So now let's, uh, and here you can see that this ID is also printed. So we just got the ID from uh, post uh, postman. Now let's uh, just take a const with the name of data and let's connect it with the database, which is MongoDB. And uh, it will basically uh, return a promise. So we must have to use here await and we can await use await inside only async functions after this data we just want to just uh, delete the record so just simply take here a result data dot delete one if you want to delete one result we can use here delete one method and here we have to put here condition let's say id and we have to just use here underscore id because this is not a simply id some guys actually just put it id and data is not actually deleting and they are just struggling, struggling with it. Here you can see that this is the uh, column name with the underscore ID. After that, we can just simply uh, use this request dot delete uh, request dot params dot ID and we can just print this result inside uh, request dot send and it will also return a uh, promise so we can again use a await. So if I'm trying to delete it, it will not delete the record. Here you can see that deleted account zero. Why? Because it cannot understand this ID like this because this is basically an object. So what we have to do, we have to just create a new MongoDB object to it. So let's take a const MongoDB and uh, just load the mongodb here with the required function mongodb and now come back here and simply put here 
न्यू मोंगोडी बी लाइक दिस एंड नाउ इट विल डेफिनेटली डिलीट द रिकॉर्ड नाउ लेट्स चेक इट वेन एवर आई एम जस्ट रनिंग इट हेयर यू कैन सी दैट अगेन इट विल नॉट रिस्पॉन्ड समथिंग मे बी देयर इज सम इशू सो लेट मी चेक वॉट्स इशू ओके सो एक्चुअली वी हैव टू जस्ट यूज हेयर मोंगो डी बी डॉट ऑब्जेक्ट आई डी now there is a no error and let's uh, try to send a request again you can see that deleted account is one now if i'm checking here you will find that this record is deleted so let's try to delete the note 5 also with the help of id and uh, you will find that this is a uh, record is again deleted so this is how you can delete the record so the interview question is so let's say if you want to delete the multiple records then how you can do that because we can just send sending her only one id for that even you can send here two ids from postman but this is not a recommended way where whenever you have multiple ids then you can send these ids in the uh, body right like a row then you can select the uh, json and uh, after that you can simply send here uh, you can select uh, yes json and uh, here you can send their uh, data inside uh, ids inside a array or inside with the object and uh, key pair and all right then you can delete the multiple record thank you so much for watching this video and please don't forget to subscribe my channel